Hi Scandi friends! Norway's Constitution Day is coming up on May 17th and because of that I'm going to make the cake that was voted the national cake in 2002 and I think it's so delicious. You can serve it just with a meringue and almonds on top but I like to add some fruit as well. So let's start mixing! So for the batter I'm going to use 8 tablespoons of soft butter, half a cup of sugar, one cup of flour, quarter cup of milk, four egg yolks, one teaspoon of vanilla extract and one teaspoon of baking powder. And for the meringue I'm going to use four uh, egg whites which I'm going to beat, one and a half cup of sugar, half a cup of chopped almonds and then I'll have one teaspoon of lemon juice. And I'm going to use two 9 inch baking pans. I will butter them and flour them before I put in the batter. I'm now going to beat the butter with the sugar and then I'll add the eggs one at the time. And then I start adding the flour a little bit at the time and then also the milk. Alright, so here put some of the flour in, mix it up and then I'll add the rest of it. And of course I have to add the baking powder to the flour. rest of the flour. Have it all together so put that in the baking form. It's been mixed. And I've added the batter to one of the pans. Spread it out with a knife. Here is the uh, second one. And then I'm going to beat the egg whites and add the sugar so we get the meringue and that comes on top of the batter. And I now beat the egg whites and then I'll add the sugar gradually. I'm also adding one teaspoon of lemon juice. And then I start adding sugar little by little. And I now can add the whipped egg whites on top of the dough. And finally you can sprinkle chopped almonds on top. And this is ready to go into the oven. I have the oven set at 350 and I'll be back in about 25 to 30 minutes to check on them. They should be done by then. So here you see the two cake pans. I just took them out of the oven. They were in the oven for 30 minutes and they are finished. I will let them cool down before I continue. And the filling for my cake is going to be a mixture of custard mixed with whipped cream. So here, mix it together. And that will be so good. Then we need another piece on top of that. And of course you can serve it just like that. However, today I'm going to add some more cream on top and then I will add the fruit on top. I 
understand it's called Kvefjordkake, but of course I don't pronounce Norwegian the correct way. <laughs> And there are a couple of ways of serving it. Uh, you can just serve it with the meringue and the almonds on top. But I like to also add some fruit to the cake. So I'll show you how I make it now. And I'm going to decorate my cake with the following. I have some raspberries, some blackberries, some blueberries, also strawberries, and I have a couple of mint leaves. So that should be fine. Let's start adding some of the fruit. Of course, I'm so excited that I'm going to taste my Norwegian cake. <laughs> I know it's going to be so good. So many good things in it. Such a nice uh, combination. And here, whoop, here's a piece of cake and I put it on my plate. So here I take a bite of my Norwegian cake. Mmm, so good. Mmm, really good combination. I definitely understand why in Norway they say it's the world's best cake. Well, this Norwegian cake is so pretty and it's so delicious and I'm sure you will love it just as well as I did. And uh, please subscribe to our channel and I love to hear from you. Let me know if you have any requests. I appreciate it. Skål! Take care. See you another day.